Okay, first off, editing your taskbar is very easy. All you have to do is go down to your taskbar and if go to properties. And here is a uh your properties menu. You can lock the taskbar so when you don't so when you click right here it doesn't resize. You can auto hide it, which is this. If you auto hide it, hit apply. And now my taskbar is gone, but it's not really gone. All you have to do is drag your mouse down there, and here it is. Then it goes back down. You just drag your mouse right there like that. You can do everything the same. Everything's the same. And then if you want to undo that, just go to properties again and uncheck it. Uh, keep taskbar on top of other windows. You usually want that, and just don't worry about that. Keep it checked. Group similar taskbar buttons that means when you have say you have two say you have two internet opens two um two internet windows open then that means that it will just say it will have one internet thing it'll have one internet bar right here and then it'll just say two next to it or how many you have open say you have four open it'll say four like that it gives you an example right there but and I'm not going to do that and quick launch. Quick launch is uh, these little buttons right here. These little buttons. And they're just easier to get to. You just got to click on one time. And then they come up. Instead of having to minimize everything and going to your desktop, you can just click them right there. I'm going to auto hide it. I'm going to uncheck it. There we go. Now it's right here. <coughs> and then if you want um toolbars like say when you're playing an iTunes song or something or Windows Media Player and you want it right down here instead of having to open it and do that you can just have it right here so if you go to right click on your taskbar again go to toolbars and then you can check uh, just click on it and then it should have a check mark next to it and then um all you have to do is open your iTunes or whatever I'll open iTunes Okay, here's iTunes. Now say I want to play a song. Say I'll just play Eruption. And then I minimize it. And now it's right here. Here it is. Right down here. And then you can you can work with everything. You can change the song. You can edit the volume. Volume right here. You can open it again with the little top right hand corner of it. And then it opens back up. And I'll tell you that, and then same that that goes for the same thing with Windows Media Player. And you ha you have other stuff too. If you go to toolbars, or you can have links. Uh, I have Google Desktop. Um, you can make your own toolbar. Um, and then if you wanna take your taskbar and move it to the side or up here on the top of your um screen. This is how you do it. Unlock your taskbar. It says lock the taskbar. Uncheck it if it's already checked. And now you'll be able to you you are able to like move it up like this and stuff like that. Well, move it to the size you want it and then click on the click on the fat part. Don't don't make it so it's arrowy. Just click where it's not arrowy and then drag it up wherever you want it. You can drag it on the sides. So you say I want it on the side, now it's on the side. And you can resize it to whatever you want. And if you want it, see here it is. And then if say you want it up here on top, there it is. It's like a Mac. And all your stuff is up here now. Same thing, everything just same. It's just up here. And then you can lock it. And then it won't move. It'll like stay there. So when you click like that it won't drag. But then I'm gonna unlock it again and drag it back down here. Like that and lock it and then you can move your icons around and whatever like that and um, thanks for watching that's how you edit your that's how you edit your taskbar and move it thank you bye